All right, so this is how I am straightening the frame. So on the ends here, we have it clamped. It's so small. See, uh, to my welding table, my makeshift welding table. That's about three eighths inch uh, mild steel. So as you can see, it's clamped on two ends right there, and then in the middle. Uh, what I have is my big clamp that's applying force in, downward in the middle right there. So what that's going to do is is pull down and straighten it because right now it's it's bent in that direction, you know, on the end. So since that's bent in that direction, in order to to straighten it, I have to bend it back up that way. So to do that, I'm applying force here, which will bend this down that way, which will take this end over here up, which is what I, I need it to do. So of course I can't just clamp onto the mild steel because even the mild steel will bend. So I reinforced it with a piece of square tubing underneath. So even with that, I don't know if you could see this uh, video but the mild steel is still bent slightly but at any rate I really cranked down on this uh, giant center clamp and it's uh, I've already measured it it's it's already bent it uh, a little bit in the proper direction so I'll leave it like this for a little bit longer a couple more hours and then I'll I'll check it for for trueness again and then if it looks good, then I'll call it good. If not, then I might just leave it like that for a day or two. Uh, and with a, the constant force, that should straighten it. Now on a bottom bracket, I went and bent everything back as well as I could. And it turns out it isn't as bad as I thought. I mean, it's still, still ripped, you know, right there. And on the on the other side right around there so you know it's still kind of bent up and ripped a little bit so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna weld it and try to use it as is if it, if it works out then great if not then you know I could always redo it but I don't think this is gonna be that big of a deal because once I put this on the bike then uh, you know the the nuts and bolts that hold it on up here end up bending the aluminum anyway uh, just from the clamping force so that's the plan and I will see if it works out